SpaceX has been hard at work on the new Starship 2.0, a massive next-generation rocket that might soon transport humans to the Moon and then to Mars. SpaceX frequently sends commercial cargo into space, as well as government cargo for the US military, and NASA works closely with SpaceX to transport supplies and humans to the International Space Station. One of the main goals of the Starship 2.0 project, according to Elon Musk, is to inhabit Mars. Given the anticipated plans for a million people to be carried to Mars, this is no little task. However, dumping a million people on Mars and expecting them to thrive is unrealistic. The first phase is to prepare the environment for their arrival, which includes life support systems, food, tools, other essentials, and tons of cargo. There is currently no spacecraft capable of transporting people from Earth to Mars, let alone the many tons of cargo Musk must transport. The Starship 2.0 towers are roughly 400 feet taller than the Statue of Liberty when fully constructed. It also stands taller than NASA's Saturn V rocket, which took American astronauts to the moon during the Apollo mission. The Starship 2.0 will be approximately twice as powerful as the Saturn V and will have a 30-foot diameter, larger than other orbiting vehicles. This will enable the simultaneous movement of large amounts of stuff or several people. Even before its first orbital test flight, the Starship 2.0 had undergone significant upgrades. SpaceX, for example, has been developing the Raptor rocket engine, which powers the Starship 2.0. SpaceX is currently working on a new version of these engines that will deliver more thrust, be easier to manufacture, and cost a lot less than the existing ones. SpaceX has also stated that the number of Raptor engines on the Starship 2.0 and Super Heavy rocket will be increased, bringing the total payload capacity of the spacecraft up to over 150 tons. In January, the United States Air Force gave SpaceX $102 million to investigate, using the spacecraft as a cargo ship that could transfer commodities to different parts of the Earth in minutes or for point-to-point -point transit. In a tenth of the time it takes ordinary military planes to transport humanitarian aid or military cargo, a Starship 2.0 might launch into orbit and re-enter a designated zone. Elon Musk claims that Starship 2.0 will be eight times larger than the current version and have an 18-meter diameter, double that of the current iteration. If SpaceX had preserved the original size of the Starship 2.0, it could lift 300 tons every launch, but this massive upgrade will more than triple that carrying capability. This is why SpaceX is working to make the Raptor and a successor cheaper and faster to produce, as a huge number of them will be needed soon. Musk intends to reduce the Raptor's price to roughly $200,000, a significant reduction from the current $2 million price tag. He could transport between 800 and 1,000 passengers every trip with the Starship 2.0, greatly reducing the number of journeys required. Starship 2.0 will also be able to carry big machinery like cranes and bulldozers without having to deconstruct and reassemble them.